Chapter 13. One Great Golf Shot Theory. That night, while watching television George acted on an inspired impulse to go grab his bag and pull out the energy book Marty had given him. As he looked through it, one section really caught his attention. It was about golf, a sport he loved to play but rarely had time for. The book talked about how after people play a round of golf they usually don't think about all the bad shots they made but rather always remember and focus on the one great shot they had that day. The thought and feeling they get when thinking about this shot makes them want to play again and again, this is why so many people get addicted to golf. The book then contrasted this with life and how people often go to bed thinking about all the things that went wrong when instead they should apply the one great golf shot theory to their life and think about the one great thing that happened that day. The one great call, meeting, or sale, the one great conversation or interaction, the one great success that will inspire them to look forward to creating more success tomorrow. This, the book said, will inspire people to get addicted to life. Well, it worked because George was inspired. He had an idea, walked into his children's bedrooms and asked each one to tell him their success of the day. He explained that it could be something great that had happened to them that day or something they were proud of. The children lit up and smiled as they recalled their successes and George knew this would be their new nightly ritual. Then he took a walk around the block with his dog and thought about his own success that day. His boss had come up to him and said, there's something different about you, George. Whatever you are doing, keep it up. It's amazing how positive energy works, George thought. Whether you have it or don't, people notice. Later on that night as he lay his head on the pillow George thought about sharing the one great golf shot theory with his team because if there was any group of people on the planet who needed to learn to focus more on the positive instead of the negative, it was they.